Well, women who serve time at a local correctional facility have officially graduated with a degree in coding. News 19's Walker Lawson has more on today's service. After 14 months, a day of celebration has taken place for 11 women who officially graduated from their coding class at Camille Griffin Graham Correctional Institution, seven of which were still in person. Brian Sterling is the director of the South Carolina Department of Corrections, who watched as those who finished the course accept their diplomas. Well, programs are while we're here. We really don't want people coming back to prison. We don't want them committing more crimes, having more victims out there. And we know programs work. Our numbers show it. The statistics show it. They're part of a program, part of education. They get their degrees here, a coding class like this with the salaries of close to 100000 or even more. We know they're most likely not going to be coming back to prison. A salary and career that one inmate says she couldn't pass up. Um, it's very exciting. Um, I'm very grateful for the chance to for a second life. Um, I have learned a lot. Actually, I have a job already lined up, and it has been a very, very challenging road. It wasn't easy. Um, of course, we had quarantine and stuff like that, but we just kept pushing and kept working and studying, and oh, it's, it's been a very bumpy road. Sterling is hopeful those who graduated once they leave here won't be returning. They'll be self-sufficient, have their careers. This is a career path. This is not just a job, but this is a career path where maybe eventually they can start their own company and pay taxes and things like that. In Columbia, I'm Walker Lawson, News 19, WLTX.